The other day I was having a chat with a customer of ours and they said, do I really need to be backing up my cloud? And I've had friends in the past turn around and say to me, I got hit with ransomware and I just dived into my OneDrive, Dropbox, whatever cloud file storage system they're using and restored the previous version. And so you kind of ask yourself, do I need to be backing up my cloud? Researchers at Proofpoint, who are an amazing email filtering and security product, recently did some research into whether or not uh, ransomware could affect files hosted on cloud file storage. In particular, they focused on Microsoft SharePoint and OneDrive, since a lot of businesses who are all using Microsoft Office 365 will also use OneDrive and SharePoint for the storage of their corporate files now that we're sort of moving all to this work from home, work from anywhere sort of world. And what they found is that any user can actually change the number of file versions that a file can have. And typically the default value is 500. So that means that you can change the file 500 times and still skip back 499 times before. But each user can go in and change that and you can change it to one. What that means is if the file is changed twice, you will lose the original version before those two changes. And changing a file just means editing the contents of the file or even doing something as benign as maybe editing the file name or changing the file ownership or, or other metadata. In their testing, what they were able to prove is that if a bad actor or threat actor gained access to your cloud file storage, they could actually go in and change all the file ver versioning uh, defaults to one and then subsequently make enough changes that you wouldn't be able to get back the files via the previous version function if they ransomed your files. And yet we're not seeing this yet as a ransomware tactic, but as more and more people move to cloud file storage, will threat actors realize that the only way they're going to uh, enact a, a successful ransom payment is to start targeting cloud storage? And so this comes back to the original question of should you be backing up your cloud storage? And, and the answer is yes. Uh, it doesn't cost a lot. Usually it's a couple of bucks, a Marbox a month, uh, but you never know what could happen. Someone could delete all of their files. And whilst, whilst Microsoft keeps files in the deleted items for 14 days, the researchers at Proofpoint found that quite often they actually couldn't restore the files from that deleted item recycle bin uh, if certain functions were enacted. So if you don't want to be the first person who finds out whether or not threat actors are ransoming file cloud storage, then you really should be backing up your cloud file storage. And then, as I said, if it's only a couple of bucks per mailbox per month, it's really a safeguard against the potential future impact of ransomware uh, targeting your cloud file storage. Anyway, hope that's been useful. Uh, just wanted to debunk that question. Um, have a great day.